Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we will discuss the following question and the question says solve 3 into x square minus 2 the whole is equal to 10 minus x square. Let's start the solution now. We are given the quadratic equation 3 into x square minus 2 the whole is equal to 10 minus x square first we will open the bracket so this implies 3x square minus 3 into 2 which is 6 is equal to 10 minus x square now we will bring the terms involving the variable on one side of equality and the constant terms on the other side of equality that is we will bring minus x square on the left hand side so the sign of minus x square would change that is we will bring minus x square on the left hand side so the sign of minus x square would change so this implies the left hand side of the equality becomes 3x square plus x square also we will bring minus 6 on the right hand side so the sign of minus 6 would change and the right hand side of the equality becomes 10 plus 6 this implies 4x square is equal to 16 we now divide both the sides by the coefficient of x square we can see that the coefficient of x square is 4 so dividing both sides by 4 we get left hand side becomes x square and the right hand side is 16 divided by 4 which is equal to 4 now take the square root on both the sides so this implies x is equal to under root of 4 which implies x is equal to plus minus 2 so x is equal to 2 and x is equal to minus 2 are the two possible solutions we will now check if these values of x satisfy the given quadratic equation first we will check for x is equal to minus 2 now substituting x is equal to minus 2 in the given quadratic equation we get 3 into minus 2 whole square minus 2 the whole is equal to 10 minus minus 2 whole square now this implies the left hand side becomes 3 into 4 minus 2 and the right hand side becomes 10 minus 4 which implies 3 into 2 is equal to 6 this implies 6 is equal to 6 So minus 2 satisfies the given quadratic equation. Now we check for x is equal to 2. Now substituting x is equal to 2 in the given quadratic equation, we get 3 into 2 square minus 2 the whole is equal to 10 minus 2 square. this implies the left hand side becomes 3 into 4 minus 2 and the right hand side becomes 10 minus 4 which implies 
3 into 2 is equal to 6. This implies left hand side becomes 6 which is equal to the right hand side which is again 6. So x is equal to 2 also satisfies the given quadratic equation. Therefore x is equal to 2 and x is equal to minus 2 is the answer for the given quadratic equation. With this we end our session. Hope you enjoyed the session.